Anderson County Park will now get a facelift valued at over $300,000. It's a first step in a master plan. 7 News reporter Asia Wilson has a look at all the changes you can expect. When you think of Dolly Cooper Park, the water may be the first thing that comes to mind, but now county leaders say they are starting a master plan to enhance the water area and other areas of the park. Some say they enjoy being on the water at Dolly Cooper Park. They're all warped up from hitting trees. For others, they find peace on the disc golf course that sits on the 45 acres of land. I like it, you know, it's a nice little exercise slash, you know, competitive thing. Unfortunately, vandals have disturbed the park's peace in the past. Now people want change. Maybe a dog park um, with like, you know, the little dog obstacles. I guess you can have more area for kids stuff because I don't really see like, like swing sets and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I think they have stuff like that for more family kind of stuff. Now Anderson County leaders will invest more than $300,000 in the first phase of a master plan. We're in the process of uh, beginning to grade out for our 1500 foot ADA approved walking trail that will be paved and and go along in and off the river a little bit. A self fueling station for Anderson County Sheriff cars will be included, which they hope will keep crime under control. For water lovers, they plan to rebuild the boardwalk and enhance the kayak launch area, which are also ADA approved. Representative Westcott, Senator Richard Cash helped us get this money into the northern part of the county so where we can make these improvements and not cost the taxpayers any increases on their property taxes. It's all enhancements these park goers hope will keep the criminals away. Hopefully scaring people off from doing bad things. County leaders are welcoming more ideas from you to enhance the park. They say there will be many more opportunities for you to give your input online and in person. In Anderson County, Asia Wilson, 7 News. County councilmen say the path for the trails already laid out. They expect construction to begin within about 60 days.